Hello everyone, I am Sir Topham Hatt, director of the railway on Sodo. Did you know that it's the 75th anniversary of Thomas and Friends this year? That's right, 75 years ago, the very first Thomas and Friends story was created by the Reverend W. Audrey for his son, Christopher. Until we meet again here at the New South Wales Rail Museum, we have arranged for a very special storyteller, Juliet, to read some of our favourite stories from Thomas and Friends. Today, Juliet will be reading How Do You Feel, Thomas? Over to you, Juliet. Today's story is How Do You Feel, Thomas? How do you feel today? Let's see what Thomas and his friends are up to. Thomas is puffing along the seaside. It's a lovely day and the sun is shining. How is Thomas feeling today? Ah, oh, Thomas is feeling very happy. Oh dear, Percy is stuck in the river. The water has put out his fire and he can't move. How do you think Percy is feeling? Let's have a look, shall we? How would you feel if you were stuck in the water? Oh, very sad. Poor Percy. Maybe he needs a hug. Here's Harold. And he is flying over the docks. He is taking the fat controller to the seaside. How is Harold feeling? How do you think Harold? Shall we see? Oh, here he goes. He's flying up in the air and he's feeling very, very excited. It'd be very exciting, wouldn't it? Flying up in Harold the helicopter. And Lucky Fat Controller going for a ride as well. Let's see who the next friend is. James. He's the shiny red engine, isn't he? He looks a little bit upset. James is travelling very fast. The troublesome trucks are shunting him along the track. Oh, how do you think James is feeling? Oh, those troublesome trucks, they can be very troublesome, can't they? He is feeling Scared. Oh, those troublesome trucks, they keep pushing him off the track, don't they? They're very troublesome. Poor James. <laughs> Diesel is in a hurry. But the signal has just come down and he has to stop. How is Diesel feeling? Can you see his face? How do you think he might be feeling? Hmm, I think he might be feeling very angry. <laughs> he couldn't get to do his job, could he? He was very cross. Here we are, back with Thomas. The fat controller has come to see Thomas. His driver has just pulled a fish out of his tank. My goodness, how did a fish get in there? How are Thomas and the fat controller feeling? How do you think they might be feeling if you found a fish inside your tank? Let's have a look. Oh, the fat controller's hat's flying off. Oh, they're feeling very surprised. I think I feel very surprised too. <laughs> we all have different feelings every day, don't we? I hope you're feeling happy today and I hope you enjoyed our story. I'll see you soon. Parents, if you enjoyed today's story, be sure to visit the New South Wales Rail Museum's website, where there are links to lots of other Thomas and Friends activities, all to be had in the safety and comfort of your own home. In the meantime, I shall stay here and make sure there is no confusion and delay.